Hi everyone. I'm Tootsie. I'm back. Um, had to take a little break. Um, I had a um death within my family, so I had to really take some time and um, reflect on, you know, getting myself together. Um, but today I want to come to you and talk about two products that I added to my hair regimen. And that would be let's see, the generic value brand. Okay, this is the uh, concentrate leave-in treatment. Um, I was using the Can2, but the Can2 is kind of heavy for the summer. So I had to find something that was kind of, you know, a little bit more lighter on my hair. So I use this, and this is really, really good. I want to come to you. I want to use it first before I come to you and talk about some how good the product is. Um, I've been using it for like three days now, and it is really, really amazing. It's real light, and it doesn't weigh your hair down because it's too hot to be having a lot of products that weighing your hair down. And the second one that I want to come to you with is the Virgin Hair um, Fertilizer. This ointment is really good um, for if you're really trying to grow your hair a little bit more thicker and longer. Um, I've been using this for like two days. And you see it's a pretty big tube you get. I put both of these. I got this one at um, Sally's. Okay. And this one I bought at my local beauty supply store. And this was $10. And this one was... Six fifty nine, but if you have your discount card, you can get it cheaper than that. It could be like four dollars and change. So, but this right here, um, I try to use this at night because the smell is not bad. I hear a lot of reviews and people just talking about how horrible the smell is. The smell is not that bad, you know. And people was comparing it to Sulfur Eight. This is not no comparison to Sulfur Eight. Sulfur Eight was like way over the top with the smell. Okay, even though it worked, but the smell is not no comparison to this. Okay, I don't know why people saying that. You must not really use Sulfur 8 if you're comparing it to this. This right here is, um, some people were saying like a peppermint smell. Really wasn't getting that. Um, but it's, when you, when you apply it, um, it does give you this penetrating feel to your scalp, which and to me it feels pretty good. But, um, the smell, I mean, if it's that bad, if you feel as though it's that bad, then just apply it at night. You know, I applied some last night, and when I was doing my hair today, um, I applied some. You know, it doesn't smell as bad as people are putting it out to be. That's my opinion. You know, because really, who wants to walk around here with some crazy smell and stuff in your hair, walking around all day? That's not me. I'm not around for that. But it's not to that. You know, after you apply it in a little while, you know, after a little while, it goes, the smell just like simmers down. So, but if you're really looking for a really good product, if you want to be able to grow more um, thickness to your hair, because I have very thin hair, so I'm just trying to grow a little bit, you know, a more thicker texture to my hair, um, then this is your product. And especially if you're trying to, you know, grow hair, then this is your product. But you have to be very religious about how you use it. You just can't use it a few times but like, oh, it's nothing, it's not working. You know, the product sucks. You have to be committed to using the product if you want your hair to grow or you want thickness or whichever the case may be. You know, but do your research, you know, um, Google this in. It'll come up and you can just hear about a lot of the things that people have, you know, raged about and it gets really good reviews. That's the reason why I went and I purchased it and I'm trying it out for myself. So, that's that one. And this one right here, um, they have a lot of different um, products of this at Sally's Beauty Supply Store. So if you have a Sally's Beauty Supply Store in your area, go check them out. Um, this one right here is by the Sebastian Potion 9. I actually never tried Sebastian's products, but they say on the back here, it's like a comparison of that. And it's pretty much the same, you know. So if you don't want to pay the top brand price that Sebastian Potion Nine is charging, then 
you go to Sally's and you pick up a bottle of this one. I love a leave-in conditioner. I, I, I love something of a leave-in treatment, you know, because I don't wash my hair. I wash my hair maybe like twice a month, you know, um, because I don't like to strip out a lot of the, um, of the, uh, in environments or whatever. I don't like to strip my hair. Washing your hair too much. A lot of people prefer to wash their hair, you know, several times a month or whatever the case may be. That's not me, you know, and you can see I'm not bald. So, and my hair is very clean, you know, that's why I love a leave-in condition, um, because it can still keep the, the ingredients and the vitamins and everything that you need, um, in your hair. Um, and that's pretty much it. These are the two products that I use. I add it to my collection. Um, I don't use a whole lot of different things in my hair. You know, I try to keep it very down to the minimum. Just like I said, these would be basically two products that I'm using um right now on top of a you know a little little gel just to basically to put you know to put my hair up. Um and that's pretty much it. You know, try not to basically just overwhelm your hair with all different types of products. You know, and definitely before you use anything, always do your own research. You know, read through reviews and you know, kinda of see what other people are kind of specifying about the product before you use it yourself. You know, I'm not on here. I'm not paid to come up on here and, and, and rage and talk about anybody's product. I see products. I see other people, you know, raging and talking about it. And I check it out for myself. I always check things out for myself um, about the product before I purchase it and use it for me. Okay. And I suggest that you all do the same. You know, um, regardless of what somebody saying, just check it out for yourself. Um, and that's it. Um... It has herbal extract, petroleum jelly, peppermint oil, and um, lanolin and fragrance. So that's what this offers. And that will be pretty much it for right now. I will be back with you real soon. I hope everyone has a wonderful day. And it's good to be back. You'll be hearing back from me real soon. Bye.